Alright guys, uh, welcome to another segment of Let's Talk Review on Let Me Speak. So, next movie I'll be reviewing is titled uh, A Triplex Diary, Soft Landing, which Soft Landing is pretty much the movie. And um, it centers around three guys, uh, Lumen, Casey, and Greg. And um, it talks about how they live in abject poverty and their struggle to be successful in tough Lagos life and Lagos Street, pretty much. Uh, it's a bright wonder movie and it featured Kalui Kiagu, Esther Aldu, uh, Osasi Yamu, who played uh, Lumen, uh, Bright Wonder, who played Greg the Stammer, and also Ike Adele, who played Casey. And um, what I like about this movie is the fact that um, it's a comedy movie, but they instilled a few more to the story, to the comedy, which makes it more interesting. So I love the script because it's it's not it's different with a twist of comedy in it. So I really, really, really liked it. It's something I think you will enjoy also. Uh, another thing I like about the movie is the sound and picture quality. It was really, really nice to see a clear picture of, of Abuja, of the beautified the street of Abuja because it was shot in Abuja. Uh, they beautify a lot of places, you know, the, the rugged area in Abuja and it was really, really, it was nice to see how they, perfection of the camera and the equipment they used to bring out all the colorful areas in Abuja. Um, the director, I think the directing is actually is amazing because the direct the director did an amazing job also. The directing, however, did fall short. I got every angle I wanted I wanted, especially for the three, you know, the three lead roles of Sasi Yamu played Lumen, Brett Wanda who played Gay, Greg and Ike Adiele who played Casey. It brought three three people with different lives, and they, they were, we were able to see that through the director uh, and the scriptwriter also. So that was really 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 nice. The sound well, this the soundtrack in the movie was nice. It wasn't the normal, you know, it wasn't there was no hip hop. There was it was just talent, I guess, fresh talent off of the soundtrack I got, and it was really 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 nice for me to listen to another, you know, soundtrack pretty much. Now, the story itself, uh, along the line, when you start thinking about comedy movie and uh, it's all comedy, all comedy, along the line, when there's no substance to the movie, it becomes a little bit boring. Yes, I got that from the movie initially after about 20 minutes of um, blankness, pretty much. But it picked up later. I liked how the movie turned out to be. It was, it was quite interesting for me to watch. Now, the person that stood out to me was Greg, Bright Wonder. And I don't think it's because he wrote the film, but it was because of the way he acted. He's stammering. He had it hands down, like, come on, shut up. I mean, the way he handled the interviewers in the movie, in the movie I thought that was really, really nice. It was, it was a wonderful job by um, Bright um, Wonder. I, like, he actually stood out to me in the entire movie. I love their chemistry and I love the climax of the movie, how the movie went from three guys into the life, into their each of their lives and their story. It was really, really, really nice. So um you want a little bit of comedy this weekend? I think this movie is the movie for you to watch. Uh it's absolutely interesting to watch. And uh for this movie, I give it a seven over ten. Really, the seven over ten is just for the comedy path. If you're into like comedy, comedy, however comedy that you can relate to. I like the sarcastic comments, the sarcastic answer of Greg. I love Lumen. I, I, that's, I think that's why I like the movie. That's why I'm giving it a 7 over 10. The cast did it for me. The, the triple A's actually did it for me. And uh, that's about it, guys, for um, trip, uh, Soft Landed. Kalu Ikeagu is a prominent actor. He, was a support, he played a supporting role as a pastor. And uh, that's about it for the movie. I totally love the climax of this movie. And I love the the, the last clip of the movie. I, I don't want to give you any spoiler alert because there's really no spoiler alert to give when it comes to comedy. And that's about it for Soft Landing. It's available on Iroko TV. And that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Don't forget to share my channel with your friends and family. And I am forcing you to go and subscribe to my channel. 
Thank you so much, guys, for listening, and have a wonderful weekend.